Doomfist is on the loose, and he may be coming really soon. How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? Force here, and today I want to update you guys about a recent revelation tweeted out by Overwatch that Doomfist was broken out of prison. He goes by the name of Akandi Ogundimu, and all this is coming from an in-universe uh, news post, and Blizzard tends to do this kind of thing when they're teasing upcoming stuff, particularly heroes. We saw the same thing prior to the release of our Risa, these news flashes about recent events in the Overwatch universe. Now, this particular one is about a security breach that happened at Helix Securities. This was essentially a, a maximum security installation that housed some of the most dangerous threats and criminals in the Overwatch universe. Well, what happened, according to this post by Blizzard, was that the Talon organization, in particular Reaper, uh, went in and broke out a Kandi Oga Demo, better known as Doomfist. And after that happened, this is basically a revelation of what happened prior to the release of Orisa, because after Doomfist broke out of his prison, or after the Talon organization broke Doomfist out, that is when they went to the Noombani airport and attacked, and that's, you know, that's, that's the events that led up to the release of Orisa. Now, what's interesting about this post, though, is that they do mention that it wasn't just Ogun Gundemo or Doomfist who was broken out there there are reports that there were other threats who broke out as well when the Talon organization went in and attacked this uh, high security installation. So what is interesting really about this to me though is that as much as we want to look at this and say Doomfist is coming, Doomfist is coming, and I still think there's a really good chance that that is the case, this tease it could be similar to the last tease that we saw and the last tease that we saw was focusing on particular on Effie. There was an article about her amazing inventions and all the stuff that she had done and then we saw the attack on the uh, airport and a lot of people assumed that Effie was going to be the next hero. Now we've got this new this new article, this news breaking news post, talking just about Doomfist. But there is a good chance that it could be, much like Effie was, just a red herring to throw us off the scent of what is going to be another Heroes release. I mean, there's been so much talk and hype about Doomfist for a long, long time. I wouldn't be surprised if Blizzard does decide to go through with it, but it's also a great diversion tactic because they know that the community is really excited about the idea of Doomfist, so they could use that as a way to kind of divert our attention as they release another hero, whoever these other threatening criminals that were in the Helix Maximum Security installation are that were broken out as Talon attacked, you know, there's other people who went out, and those could also be uh, potentially who we end up seeing as the next hero. Either way, it's interesting. This is all like it has been in the past, leading up to something big. Probably happening this week or early next week. It is almost guaranteed, I would say, at this point, that we're going to be seeing the new hero coming to the PTR of Overwatch. So whether it's Doomfist or he's just a red herring for another hero, a new hero's coming very, very soon. That's pretty exciting stuff. All right, everybody, that's going to do it for me here today. As always, I want to thank you all so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoy the video, and until next time, I'll see you later.